have found, by we I mean Daniel very much found this, <laughs> the cutest little heart pond mini lake area and we got ourselves some breakfast. Breakfast Super healthy here, you know. We like to keep things really healthy and oh my gosh. delicious. There probably are a lot better little diners here in the city to eat at, but we just went with the McDonald's because we, we have- We needed something quick and easy. We got some shoots to get to, guys. We're We've excited got a busy about this. Day. But we, uh, we're not allowed to eat in the McDonald's, so we brought our food to this nice, little park pond area. We're it's totally beautiful. here like all alone and it's just gorgeous. We found a bench with the view. Daniel knows I love water and views. I'm all about that and so that's what he found me. We found it. We're gonna go ahead and eat, enjoy our view and then we're gonna start shooting guys. We're gonna go meet up with the bride, start the shoots. We got a busy, busy day. It is a long day of wedding festivities and we're honestly so excited and I just am so grateful to do it with him. I love shooting with him. If you are out there and you're getting married and you're not sure if you want to budget in a videographer and a photographer I highly recommend doing both there are just so many things that like a video captures that's just so much more like tender emotion almost than I feel like it's just such a different feeling I am a definitely a believer in having both at your wedding photo and video not just one not just the other and you know what we're pretty fun so like hire us. <laughs> <laughs> all right babe break that bag open okay one for you This is my favorite part. <laughs> <laughs> All right, time to get to work. So, everybody, we are sorry. We generally like to bring you content as it's happening, we kind of narrate all. along the way. But today we're gonna have to do one of these little recap videos. They're not my favorite, bear with us, I'm sorry. But we had no time to really narrate, get the like kind of video throughout the day and fill you in on what was going on during the wedding day because it was so busy. We were so busy getting video of everything and everyone at the wedding party that you guys kind of took a back seat. I'm sorry about that. We still will share some clips with you from the beautiful, beautiful day, and we're gonna tell you all about it right now. You guys, it was such a whirlwind of a day. It was honestly so much fun. We were out in Atlantic, Iowa, shooting a wedding for the beautiful Caitlin and the handsome Wyatt, and it was so much fun. We got to see some of the most beautiful landscaping in Iowa that I've ever seen. We've never been to Iowa, but it was absolutely gorgeous. Just like open fields as far as you can see, and it was, oh, it was like a photographer's paradise, I feel like. Just like all the open fields, the cute little like silos and water towers and barns. Like it was so beautiful. We absolutely loved it. We loved being able to meet and getting to know Kate and Wyatt's family. That was so much fun. Thank you guys so much for bringing us out and having us capture your special day. It was a blast. We absolutely loved it. Everybody was so sweet. Loved all the people that we met from Iowa. So far, nicest people ever. Like they know how to party, let me tell you. Like that <laughs> wedding was a party and it was so fun. By the end, everyone's like singing karaoke on the sound machine. The DJ is playing the best country music. I love country music. Daniel's not a big fan. You guys know. Daniel loves like rock music and things like that. He's a mad guitar player and drummer, so he's like way into that genre, which is great. I mean, don't <clears throat> get me wrong. I totally am a sucker for country music. They had some good so country music playing. It was so fun. Yeah, one of my favorite parts of the day was her dad actually is like this collector of tons Tons of classic cars, like late 60s, and they are beautiful. And they definitely so like, and like integrated rare. them into the wedding. Mm -hmm. He let them drive off in one of the cars. He had another one parked at the venue. We used that to do a lot of our flat lay photography, videography, and it was so cool. They were beautiful. It was so cars. cool. And he had a little license plate made that said Kate and Wyatt, and the way he spelled it out was like so cute. We'll show you guys in the video. It was so beautiful. And these cars are like incredible. They are beautiful cars. I don't know a lot about cars but I can appreciate like a good looking <laughs> car. Like I totally will see a car and I'll be like, oh my gosh, I love that thing, I wanna photograph that. My dreams came true with that one because these cars were so incredible. And he owns a lot of like really rare vintage cars. Like there's only, you know, like 40 of them ever made or, you know, some small crazy number of cars that are ever made and he owns one of them. Like, I don't know. It, it made really it fun cool. to video and photograph. Just because yes. having a bride and groom and a beautiful car, like there's not much. Oh, and her that. dress. 
I want that. You want it? I yeah. want that. <laughs> it was gorgeous with her long veil and like when the wind would catch it, it oh, was we had some wind so too. beautiful. Yeah, so we had a lot of wind. It would catch that veil and it would pull it out to the side and that's like any movement in the video, I'm all over it. I love it. It was a dream. It honestly was like so beautiful. So, so beautiful. Okay, I need to rent your dress one day and photograph it because ship it, it was so beautiful. Yeah, just ship it on out here. <laughs> It was such a fun day, and I really just love being able to work with this guy right here. You do? I really do. He's the greatest. We just like, I mean, I know we're married, so obviously, you know, we go together, but I just feel like we work well together. We're able to like tag team situations well. Sometimes I'm like, babe, you're in my shop. Or he's like, babe, can I get that? And I'm like, yeah, <laughs> you know? Getting like a photo duo team that works well together at a wedding, I will say is like a huge, huge bonus for you brides and grooms. Rooms, but being able to do it with my husband, I mean, that's just a little cherry on top. Give me a little kiss right You're here. You're so corny. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Guys, after the wedding, we were dead. We were like, should we do a little video wrapping up the day? And it just didn't happen. We were transferring gigabytes and gigabytes of files. So, so much. We uh, did not get around to that. No, and then... we were exhausted. From the second we woke up, we were working and didn't stop until we got back to our hotel that night. We were, this is disgusting, drenched in sweat. Oh, it that was. That was another favorite part of my day. Oh my gosh. Can we talk about that? Seeing my sweat marks all over my body. All right, so we were out in it this field capturing awesome stuff. We had <laughs> the whole gorgeous. wedding party there. It was beautiful. We had clouds coming in and out. It was a really, really pretty setting out in this field, but it was hot and it's humid back there. Mm -hmm. And it's very dry here in Utah. So the humidity, I don't know if it's we aren't in it that often, but it gets a little sweaty out there. <laughs> This was the best part. So first of all, I've got camera straps all over me. I'm a little bummed I don't have any video of this, but Shell had two cameras on her. And you know, <laughs> the straps are pressing hard against your body. Yeah, I mean, they're like laying hard against cameras my body. Heavy. We're walking back to the car and we're all just like drenched in sweat. I feel so bad for the groom and all the groomsmen because they're in like full blown suits, like long white shirts, jackets, very, very handsome suits, I must say. Those suits were really good looking. So they're just like melting. So so hot and I'm in a black dress and Daniel's all in black so we're so hot so we walk back we get in the car I've got like a sweat mark this way I've got sweat marks straps down my back I've got a huge sweat mark on my back from where my camera has been sitting so I'm like chugging water and then Daniel puts the car in drive and starts to go and I'm chugging water through this water bottle that kind of has like a bigger opening and so when he starts to go I just like <laughs> Built water all down the front of me. So then by the time we get to the ceremony. Yeah, that was pre-ceremony. <laughs> that was pre-ceremony. Like right before the ceremony. We get to the ceremony and I looked like a straight disaster. I had water all down the front of me, but it just looks like sweat because the back is all sweat. And you had the sweat bandoliers from your strap. <laughs> and I was also wearing a belt, so I had a sweat mark here from my... So needless to say, we're glad it was a little bit dim oh my gosh. in the chapel during the ceremony because I don't think anyone saw that. Oh my gosh. We like got there a little early and I like went in a room and I was just like blowing my dress out trying to like dry my clothes. Daniel's like blowing his shirt off. I was like, man, we sure look professional here. Oh, just yeah. like sweaty, disgusting and messes. We, we, we were definitely on display during the ceremony because we went yeah. up back up on the stage for shots and things like that and it was very beautiful. Yeah. But I don't think anyone noticed, so at least no one's said anything. <laughs> Thank you if you did notice for not saying anything. I wouldn't be mad if you did. I, uh, it was a scorcher. <laughs> I know. The next day we woke up and we had an early, early flight and we yeah. just booked it back here to our little buddy Louie so we can spend Louis. at least half a day with him because right now, guys, we're actually heading out that door. We're off to somewhere new. We're heading up to Jackson Hole for some very, very cool things. We'll fill you in on that in the next video. It's just going to be another quick little trip, couple days. Home for less than 24 hours and then gone again for a quick couple days. Tons and tons of beautiful content coming your way. Get excited, it's gonna be double content action. Blah, blah, coming at ya. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> You're a good dancer. Okay, right, we're road tripping. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye.